Lady Gaga's application for a new range of wine has been suspended. The 31-year-old singer's representatives were recently said to have filed documents for the rights to white and red wines. Joanne Trotteria Vino Blanco and Joanne Trotteria Vino Rosa, named after the Bornless Way hitmaker's late aunt, but another company already owns the rights to Trotteria. According to The Blast, as a result of the discovery the United States Patent and Trademark Office have suspended Gaga's application because they believe it would cause confusion in the marketplace if she released a range of beverages with the same name and Trotteria filed paperwork for the rights to the title back in 2015. Last month, it was reported Gaga's reps had filed docs for the rights to use the names for wine, prepared wine cocktails, wine coolers, wine punches and prepared alcoholic cocktails. The moniker is close to Gaga's heart because it is the title of her father Joe Germanata's New York City-based Italian restaurant, also inspired by her aunt. This comes after Gaga, whose real name is Stephanie Germanata, filed paperwork to produce wine, wine coolers, wine cocktails and wine punches with the name Grigio Girls last February. The proposed beverage brand shares its moniker with a bonus track from Gaga's 2016 album Joanne, and was inspired by the star's cancer-stricken friend and former assistant Sonia Durham, who sadly lost her battle with cancer in May. The pop star used to get together with her pals, open a bottle of wine and cry for their buddy. Last November, Gaga paid tribute to her aunt, Joanne Stephanie Germanata, who passed away at the age of just 19 from autoimmune disease lupus, following her Grammy nominations, including a Best Pop Vocal Album nod for Joanne. The album and its title was inspired by her late relative, 